With the recent construction of a new performing arts center, Christian Brothers High School has expanded opportunities for student involvement in the arts. Making the most of the new theater, senior Emily Davis wrote and directed her own play as part of the student-produced One Act. Writing and submitting One Act is simple. You write a small play, it's about 15 to 20 um, pages, and then begins the rehearsal process. To look upon the hideous god of war. With acting, you're told what to do, and with directing, you're kind of trying to figure that out on your own. It's a lot of trying to figure out what you're doing and how to do it the best way possible. Additionally, the choir room of the new theater houses classes for students like senior Matthew Miles, who wakes early every morning for zero period vocal jazz. I get here around 6.45, um, but class starts at 7. We sing like a lot of songs, um, whether they're pop songs or not. Um, just It's just getting together and going to competitions and stuff and singing um, jazz pieces. Once you're on the stage and you just finish everything, it feels really rewarding and just pays off. Although the theater is home to a variety of different programs, one consistent draw for CB's performers is the friendships they make. I'd say my favorite part is just kind of coming together with everyone in the morning. Um, it's kind of nice to be able to sing with other people and also get to like form bonds with them. I love the people. We're a family. We love each other. There's so many opportunities for us to be friends and to be close together that us all being thrown into this crazy situation and this crazy experience really bonds us. Because I've been doing theater for three years at, at CB, um, I've seen a lot of people come and go, and so being that person that's leaving, I'm excited to see what the new people will bring and what the younger generations will bring. Because I have my own experiences and they'll be different from those people who come in. And so seeing what happens in the future with them, I'm really excited about that. Aiden Smith-Fagan, KBFT, Talon Morning News.